today I am making soy wax candle for soy wax candle we need soy wax flakes fragrances I am choosing one sandal and another one I am choosing a jasmine fragrance colors only if you like wicks and containers you can see this is soy wax and this is very creamy in nature and so uh, like very creamish kind of uh, texture will come in your soy wax candle first we heat the soy wax Now you can heat the soy wax and uh, as we heating we have to take care of this like we have to heat uh, wax at the very low flame and this is very important part you should not uh, uh, heat at the high flame because if you are heating at the high flame it will become black so uh, you need to avoid this thing you have to heat at very low flame and let it melt. Now in the meantime, we will place the wicks into the containers. We have to take care the wick should point at the center. With the help of the toothpick, we can make it a stand. Now you can see, the, this is the melted wax. I am taking the sandal one first. Now I am mixing fragrance into it. In 250 ml, I used to mix uh, 20 ml of the fragrance. 250 ml uh, of wax is there then I have to mix around 20 ml of fragrance now I am mixing the color If you want to be more bright, you can add more color. If you want to be lighter, so just add a little color. I want a little lighter, so I'm not adding more color into this. So this one is my sandal one. 
stir it properly slight stirring is required Same way, I am going to make jasmine soy candle. Now adding the jasmine. Same way, I am adding the sandal. The ratio is for every 250 uh, ml of wax, you have to add some 20 ml of fragrance. Now I am adding color. Very light color I am adding. I think little more color is required to make it light blue. Pour it into, into the container. Now we need to just leave it like that. Once it is hardened, we have to close these containers so so this is how we created the soy wax candle 